Ram Gunnery Sergeant R. Lee Ermey. I am your senior drill instructor. From now on, you will speak only when spoken to. The first and last words out of your filthy sewers will be, sir. Do you maggots understand that? Sir, yes, sir. Bullshit, I can't hear you. Sounds off like you've got a pair. Sir, yes, sir. If you ladies leave my island, if you survive recruit training, you will be a weapon. You will be a minister of death praying for war. But until that day, you are pukes. You are scumbags. You are the lowest form of life on earth. You are not even human beings. You are nothing but a lot of little unorganized grabastic pieces of amphibian shit. <laughs> my orders are to weed out all non-hackers who do not pack the gear to serve in my beloved corps. Do you maggots understand that? Sir, yes, sir. All right. <laughs> The main thing that I'm concerned about is being up here and being able to talk to your folks today. And am I glad to be here? You goddamn right I'm glad to be here. Hurrah, Semper Fi! I predict that anybody that comes in the military for the next 10 years can pretty well count on going to war and putting a whole lot of decorations on their chests and spending a lot of, a lot of time away from their families. And it's a sacrifice that we make. And it's a sacrifice that we don't even think twice about making. We just do it. And the reason we do it is because we are Americans. God damn it, we are free because of the people who fought in World War II, World War I. Nobody just handed us that, that privilege of being free people. Look at that flag back there. We had to earn that right. And the people who earned that right for us are not the assholes that think they can put their heads in the sand and it'll just go away. They're the people right here in front of me right now and I, that I have the huge, most huge, tremendous respect for of anybody in, on God's green earth. And with that, that was the most important message that I had. I wanted to let you know exactly what's going on back in the States. We're behind you 100%. Oh, by the way, I, uh, I declared war on Barbara Streisand after I heard her talking about Saddam Hussein being the uh, president of uh, Iran. I got a little upset and I shot her an email and I said, you goddamn big nose bitch, I challenge you to a goddamn boxing match. Her people emailed me back and declined. And that was two days later. And that, when I got that email, I kind of heaved a sigh of relief. What if she'd have accepted and kicked my ass? <laughs> Three things. One is God bless our commander in chief, George Bush. Hoorah! God bless the men and women who are sacrificing their freedoms right now to make sure that everybody else is free. Hoorah! And God bless America! Over on the Simpsons season premiere, Lisa's going to our camp and you are never going to believe who she's hanging with. Clever TV has the full report up next.